Well, nationwide school districts are battling teacher shortages. And that means districts have to get creative in attracting the best and brightest. Yeah, Elise Brown shares how Portsmouth Public Schools is innovating. Behind the storm. Um, once we finish this, then you're going to go back and finish your posters and stuff. Janine Perry Campbell teaching science. What are some of the abiotic factors? Rocks. Rocks. Water. Perry Campbell loves seeing former students succeed. One about to finish med school. And just to know that I had just a little bit to do with him going on to medical school is just so heartwarming. It's moments and stories like those that keep the educator of 12 years going. But not everyone who gets into teaching stays. Also, some grads not wanting to apply. Salary playing a part. Earlier this year, the Virginia Department of Education says there were 800 unfilled positions. We have a nationwide shortage of teachers right now. Um, so we're always looking for the best teachers to come to Portsmouth. HR Director Scott Ziegler says the district has to get creative for recruitment. For three months, employees have been up and down the East Coast. But this year added incentives to people who join the team. We are offering a thousand dollar up to a thousand dollar moving allotment for any teacher who moves from out of state. And they've partnered with apartment complexes to offer reduced rates. Ziegler hopes this helps the district remain competitive. Systems are battling for science, technology and math teachers. Oh, there's that much competition now, so teachers are are waiting for what they consider the dream job. Perry Campbell living her dream, helping students soar. She hopes people also in the science field give teaching a chance. But it's so rewarding. In Portsmouth, Elise Brown, 13 News Now.